Welcome to the System Console Overview training video. My name is David Garcia, and we will go through this training together. In this training, we're going to cover many aspects of System Console. What is System Console? How System Console works? The most common ways you can use System Console? And we will go through a simple System Console demonstration with a simple design implemented in hardware, so you can see by yourself how System Console can be used. System Console provides you with low-level access to your design running on an Intel FPGA, helping you with your debugging process. System Console interacts with IP cores that you can invoke and implement in your design according to your needs. We call this logic debug agents. System Console also provides you with toolkits, which are GUI-based applications inside System Console that give you valuable information when debugging interface links, like PCIe, external memory, or Ethernet links. System Console communicates to your design through debug agents. Debug agents are the soft logic embedded in some Intel FPGA app that provide communication to System Console. Here, we are showing three examples of these debug agents, the JTAG UART IP, the JTAG to Avalon host bridge IP, and the in-system sources and probes IP. This debug IP must be instantiated in your design and connected to the parts of your design you wish to communicate with. These connections are shown with the green arrows. After adding this to your design, compile the design and program your device. Quartus will automatically create the System Level Debug Hub, or SLD Hub for short, which is a component that provides the logic for System Console to communicate with the debug agents in your design. System Console running on the host PC communicates with your design IP blocks through the System Level Debug Hub and the IP with debug agents. There are two ways you can use System Console. First, the interactive mode, where you can utilize Debug Toolkit's GUI to access debug and telemetry data for your IP. These toolkits are specifically designed to aid you in debugging IP such as transceivers, external memory interfaces, Ethernet, or PCIe interfaces. For example, in the PCIe toolkit, you can see the current state of the interface, the data link speed, and the LTSSM state transitions. To look for any available toolkits in your design, open System Console and go to the Toolkit Explorer pane. You will see any available toolkits in your design. For more advanced users, System Console also has tickle scripting support to help with users looking to automate tasks. The scripts can be run through the System Console Tickle interface or from the OS command line. If you want to expand your knowledge about System Console, the debug agents it can interact with, or the available commands for System Console, make sure to check out these additional resources.